It's locked. I need to find another way out. What? Locked? Oh my. Ooh! Ooh! <gasps> Spurting Rabbit home video. Ooh. Hey yo guys, what's going on? It's me, Adrian Lucio, and welcome to the house. Um, this is a new game that released on HIO and it looked pretty interesting. And uh I really don't know what it's about, but let's check it out. New game. Let's see what's going on with this. Bio setup utility. Oh. Yeah, I've never been in the BIOS before. But I know you can like change stuff in the computer. Loading. This is a cool loading screen actually. I mean see what's going on with this. The tragic events of that day still intrigue not only the FBI but the whole country, and it has become one of the most bizarre cases that has ever never been solved. There are reports of people who say they hear the deafening screams just by going near that place. Ooh Unsolved Mysteries, Colorado nineteen seventy nine. So this is like a PS1 type game right now. Um, polygon counts ain't too high. Amanda, why does your family have a house here in the middle of nowhere, Scott? Oh my gosh, what, what the heck is this dude's face? Yeah, they didn't have enough polygons for him. Uh, Scott, I think it belonged to my great grandfather. The oldest man bought this house at my auction a long time ago. My family never managed to sell it, and it was abandoned for some years. So, now it is mine. Oh my, Brian! Get this dude some lotion, dude! Of course they did it. This house is falling apart. How old is it? Relax, bro. The furniture is almost new. Ashley? At least she looked kind of normal. I can't believe I left my aero aerobics class for this. Guys, nobody in my family wants this house. We can do whatever we want here. Nobody will care if we break something, have a party, or even demolish this crap. Okay, okay. You already convinced me. Ashley and I will go in and have a look around the house. Man, these high school teenagers always been on that bull. I'm excited for today. I've always had a crush on Scott. He just recently broke up with my friend Sarah, so I don't want to be a... A scumbag. I only came on this trip because Ashley didn't want to be the only girl here. I better hurry up and get my backpack out of the van. All right. Whoa, we in the game now, bro. Look at this dude, Scott. What is your face, man? All right, so we got Scott, and um, I already forgot our character's name. I think her name was like Ashley or something. Van. I can't open it. Maybe Scott can help me. Alright, help me, man. Give me the keys. I will check the tires before I park the van near the house. You can go ahead. Here's your backpack. You can put it in the uh, bedroom on the second floor. Okay, thanks. Okay, so our name's Amanda. Quick backpack. So we can run? Woo! I'm out of here. I thought this was. Nope. Can't leave. Oh, okay. I guess we're going down this path. Noise. Ominous. You hear this music? The house. Yo, I like this game's intro, man. <laughs> that was like the start of a freaking slasher movie. Okay. Got the house. We about to get white girl wasted over here. Nah, man, we can't be getting wasted. It's about to be a killer out here. What's going on? Ooh, this house is dingy. Y'all gonna put some lights on or something? Brian, this place doesn't look so bad. Ashley must be in the bedroom upstairs, putting her things away. Oh my gosh, dude. Why you got some... Look at this new hair, man. Okay, let's go check out... Uh... What was her name? I don't even remember. But the girl's upstairs, so let's go see what she's doing. I should put my things away first. Door is locked. What about this one? This is the right door? Oh yeah. So Ashley. Hey, 
Put your stuff on the other bed. I'm going downstairs to drink some water. Okay. Go drink your little water then. Now I can meet everyone downstairs. Wow, that backpack had no weight to it. Maybe we didn't really bring that much. What's going on over here, huh? It's locked. Let's go downstairs. See what everyone's doing, dude. What y'all doing down here, huh? But they start a little party up? Oh, what's that on the table? March 6, 1944. Missing Noah Campbell. Two days ago, the 17-year-old boy, Noah Campbell, was hunting with his father when he disappeared in the woods. Today, the police found the boy's blood in a piece of his pants in an area known to inhabit mountain lions. The boy's body was not found at the scene, indicating that the boy managed to escape the attack. So, um, what's going on, Ashley? This dang tap doesn't work. Can you go outside and ask Scott to fix this crap? Oh my gosh. Why can't you do that? It's very dark in there. Okay, so where's Scott at? Is he outside? Dude was at the van. He wasn't doing nothing. Oh man, this house is creepy already. Why are we staying here? Like, dang, man. Y'all gonna get in at your house? Why we gotta go to this old house? You hear this static right now? Look, it's menacing. Oh, man. Okay, we on the back? Yo, we got a little uh, cabin over here. What's going on, huh? Got some loot in here? Got a bucket. Don't need that right now. I'm guessing we're gonna need that later, though. Okay, well, let's go talk to Scott. There seems to be some problem with the plumbing in the house. The taps don't work. Brian told me we are going to the next town to buy some drinks and sometimes and something to eat. I will call a plumber as soon as I get there. We have to shake this place up. Did you bring the radio? This is a very old house. There must be a radio somewhere. Can you and Ashley go look for it while we do the shopping? Sure. Oh, so they're leaving. Don't leave me! Come back! Nah, man. They're leaving us here. How are you gonna leave the two women at the house, man? We more vulnerable than you. It seems to be a piece of something. Okay, so I guess we're by ourselves now. Gotta look for a radio, and I do not like this. They're leaving us alone, man. Why? I get that y'all don't think this is gonna be a murder, but I know this is a horror game. Where the heck is Ashley? So I know something's about to pop off. Okay, let's go upstairs. Ashley! Wait, wasn't she down in the kitchen, actually? She's not down there anymore? Oh, we got something in this room. Got a key and an old paper. Honorable discharge. This is to certify that Henry F. Smith, Medical Research Department, Army of the United States, is hereby honor honorably discharged from the military service of the United States of America. This certificate is awarded as a testimonial of Homestand's faithful service to his country. Date 13 September 1943. Man, that's old. We in the old times, man. Hold up, did I check those rooms? Yeah, I did. So there's nothing upstairs. Is she in here? Hold up, there's like a little room down here. Oh, there she is. Why are you standing here? I would help you, but I don't want to wear out my favorite fingernails messing around with this old house. You can put the radio on this table if you find it. Wow. Wow. Of course we gotta bring this complainer, girl. Man, I hate people like that. Okay. So this room opened now. And there's a radio. Here's a radio. I better take this downstairs. Okay, what's that right there? Flashlight. Maybe this will be useful. Oh gosh. I don't like the sound of that. We can build some flashlight. Dude, it's already dark enough as it is in this house. See how dingy this crap is? Go in this room. Okay, so we're putting the radio right there. Done. Okay. It's not working. It seems that the batteries are missing. Are you serious? Got anything in the fridge? Empty. I mean, it makes sense. This house is looking old. Oh! What? 
What? We can go in here now? Hold up, where's my flashlight? Oh, we can go in here now because I have a flashlight. Okay. There's probably some batteries in it. Yo, this music, dude. This ambiance noise is too creepy. It's, it's dripping noises. Okay, where are the batteries at? Where are the triple A's at? It's locked. Where are the dural cells at? Okay, we've got some batteries. Nice. This is mad creepy in here. Rebuilding brain tissue seemed crazy at first. I've worked with this all my life, and now they discard me like an animal. I've served so much time, so many secrets, so many deaths. They forced me to sign a confidentially document so all of my work, my life story, stayed in the army. Oh, that's the killer. That's the killer, 100%. Dude was in the army, and they discarded him like it was nothing. And now he wants revenge. Okay. Oh! No. I'm a little dizzy. I must be dehydrated. What was that? What the freak was that? Okay. Radio batteries going. It's working now. I'll ask Ashley if she brought a water bottle. You better have something. Did you bring a water bottle? No. Why would I wouldn't have that? This dump wouldn't have water. I'm not feeling very well. I'm a little dizzy. If I know Brian and Scott, well, they won't bring anything non-alcoholic to drink. There's a well next to the house. Go there to drink water. If you get worse, we can go to the hospital. I am sure there's nothing serious. I'm going there. Yo, why your face looking weird? Her face look like Duvaline, bruh. So we got this euphoric music playing now. And we're gonna go to the well outside. So let's go do that. I don't think this is a good idea. Why are we drinking water from a dang well outside? That's gonna give me some freaking malaria. Oh, I found a path over here. I see something. Is this where the well is? Oh yeah. Wait, I'm gonna need that bucket. Oh my gosh. Well, there must be some bucket around this house. Why didn't you just pick it up before? Oh, I guess I gotta go all the way back now. All right, bucket acquired. Let's go get this. Yo, I bet you there's something about to pop off here. I bet you we're about to put that bucket in there and the blood's gonna come out. Watch, I'm calling it. I'm calling it. You owe me $5 if I'm right. Look at this. Look at this. I bet you that was about to pop off. All right, about to get my little water. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. Oh. Wow. That is mega slow. Oh, never mind. I guess just normal water. I still don't trust that. It seems that the bucket came with a key. Wow, that's convenient. Okay. So we got a key now. Um, maybe that opens the door in the house that we haven't opened yet. Okay, what's, what's going on with this music? What's going on with the music? No, man. You already know my horror senses are going off. Games don't play sounds like that for nothing. Okay, let's go upstairs. Okay, so we checked out those rooms. This is the room that we're staying in. And then we have this room right here. So this room's unlocked now. All right. What we got in here? This place is empty. I expected something more interesting. Oh. Wow. Why was there a key in the well? Why would someone lock that place and then dump the key? For no reason. Scott, we're back. Finally, you're here. What took you so long? We had some unforeseen problems. I had to call the plumber, who can only come tomorrow morning. We brought the drinks. Did you find the radio? Yes, it was on the one of the rooms on the second floor. Right. What are we waiting for? Let's party! Oh my god. What? Oh my gosh, we just busting down here? What the heck? What? Yo. This got to be the most lame party I've ever seen in my life. What is this?
Okay, so I guess we busting down over here. What's going on, Brian? Do you like my new dance moves? Yeah, not really. What's going on, Ashley? What are you waiting for? Come dance with us. Maybe later. I think I'm the only normal one in this group. What the heck is she doing? Turn this off. I'm crashing the party. Nope. Can't do nothing. This music is so cool. All right, I'm out. Oh. Oh, what was that? Yo, that scared me so bad. Oh. Someone just get shot? What was that noise? Hey, yo, what's going on here, huh? Yo, that was not normal. What was that? What was that? I heard a pop noise. Wait, is that our tires outside? Yo, someone's slashing our tires? Someone just did something, huh? What's going on with the van? We good? We good? Bro, just leave. Just leave. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm scared. I'm scared. Hold up, let's go check out that room I locked, or the room I opened before. Something in here? <gasps> what is that? Hole. Why would I go in this hole? Oh my gosh. Is this the killer's den? What is that? What the? Okay. I got a note. After a while, a huge emptiness and depression overwhelmed me. I was lost, but it seemed that God guided him for my purpose. For a while, I was confused. He knocked on my door. His leg was bleeding profusely. I thought of bandaging it, but I felt that this visit was not a mere coincidence. I started cutting his tendons. Poor boy. He was screaming without knowing the greatness of his existence. I was so euphoric that slowly his heart stopped. But this event cleared my mind. And now I knew what had to be done. God guided him to me. I could not interfere in his destiny. What? Dude, we in a house with a killer right now. The test with the last corp was almost a success. But it seems that the body didn't last more than 30 seconds. Sheriff Campbell always hated me. He was sure that I was involved in the disappearances of that danged boy. who was his, ne his nephew, which didn't help much. They went through my house and found some experiments with rats in the basement, which was enough to destroy all of my work. All of my progress has now been absolved by the foundation of the house. It's just a matter of time for me to reach perfection. What? So the boy was that dude's nephew, and he killed him for his experiments. And now they found his experiments, and they destroyed all of his work. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We need to leave. We need to leave. You already know it's a serial killer when they're watching some weird junk on TV. I'm out. All right, I'm out. Get me out. <gasps> what? I'm in the basement. How the heck did I end up here? I thought I was... What is you doing, Scott? We'll be build a fire outside. I'll wait for you there. Who is this guy? This dude just came out the... Nah, man. Why were you creeping down here? Scott? Is you the killer? So they're building a fire outside. <sighs> dude. They did not just had to do me like that. Okay. What they doing out here? Building a little fire? This is the worst spot to be, man. Y'all gonna die. I found a strange room in the basement with some sinister notes. I don't know if I will have the courage to sleep in this house. No one has lived in this house for decades. If the first owner was a dangerous person, he must be in the 
diapers or has already kicked a bucket. I'm not sure about this. No imbecile is going to come walk into this house in the middle of nowhere because of his bloodlust. This only happens in the movies. Maybe in Los Angeles. Try to relax a little bit. You must be right. Don't listen to him. Dude was creeping down in the basement. Ashley. Don't you think you've had too much to drink? Oh my gosh, Brian. What? You need some cream, man. Get some lotion. But I haven't finished my first beer yet. This is the tenth time you've said this, and you're always holding a different can. Whatever. Scott, my brother, your parents are so cool to give you a house. To be honest, my parents did not give me this house. They are cheapskates. They didn't even know we came here. Bro, why you got that ramen here right now? Cool. You're the man, Scott. Dang it, Scott. Are you serious? I did a lie when I said that this was a house is abandoned. My parents don't care. Just relax. The only things we have to worry about is an eye collector maniac. While brutally murdering his victims, he liked to gouge out their eyes while they were still alive to keep as a souvenir. I heard that his favorite victims were women. Besides, this house was the place where he made his last killing. Why would you say that? Like, dude, we are here. I've never heard about this. You're making it up. That was a long time ago. Of course you have never heard of it. You told me it was not dangerous here. I was just trying to calm you down. Shut up, Scott. I need to take my allergy medication. I'm going in. Me too. I'm tired of being around these a-holes. Come on. I'm just kidding. Bro, you trash. You trash. How are you going to sit here and talk about murderers and they like to kill women? You realize how that makes me feel? Look at these dudes. Sitting here. Y'all the first to go, okay? I'm getting out of here with Ashley. Come on, Ashley. Let's leave. Dip these. Dip out of here. Skip these fools. Okay, let me go get my stuff. I'm going to go get my backpack. And then I'm out. And then I'm out. Is that Ash Ashley right there? What's she doing? Drinking an empty stomach was not a good choice. I'll eat something. I'm gonna go get my backpack and I'm gonna get out. Grab it. Woo! Okay, we got the backpack. Time to get out of here. Time to. Oh! What the heck is this? Oh my gosh. Now we're in a. F dang. I don't even know what this is. Oh! Okay. Holy snap! This medication makes me a little sleepy, but what time is it? Where's Ashley? So that was just a dream? I thought I was leaving the house. I didn't go to sleep. What the crap? Oh my gosh. It sounds like somebody's screaming in the basement. That's Ashley. She's dead. He's dead. Okay, I would not go there, down there by myself. I'm gonna go get Scott. I need to check if everything's okay. Why would you go by yourself? Well, we're about to die. We're about to die. Turn on the flashlight. What's going on here? Huh? What's going on here? Huh? Anybody in here? I already saw this note. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What the heck is happening here? What? What is that? I didn't even see that before. It's a dead body. Is that. No, that's someone else. Okay. It's not Ashley, thank goodness. Let's get out of here. We need to leave now. We need to leave now. We need to leave now. It's locked. I need to find another way out. What? Locked? Oh my. Ooh, ooh! <coughs> Stay away from me. Oh my. Oh. This dude, Scott. <laughs> Scott. 
Are you a maniac? I collect her? What? No. That doesn't even exist. I was just making fun of you. The only person who died in this house was my great grandfather. He died the first day he came here, but he was old and died of a heart attack. Ashley ran out to the basement. I thought you would be braver. Are you effing kidding me? I saw her effing body in the basement, Scott. Are you trying to scare me, too? I'm serious. Crap. She might have tripped on the stairs. Her body was on the dang ceiling. What? You trying to play a trick on me? I'm effing serious. What's your problem? Okay, let's check it out. No, give me that stick, man. Give me that weapon. Ooh. What was that? Oh, you got took. You got took out. Why did you lock the door, Scott? You're gonna get us killed. What is this red light? Wait, this wasn't here before. This is a new hallway? Oh my gosh, man. This is a death chamber. What the F is that? Brian? What has this thing done to you? Um, bleat. What the heck are you? A effing parasite? No. I'm more. I need to get out of this place now. What happened to him? What is going on, man? This is weird. There's no way that's real. What? Oh! No! Get out! This house is weird, man! It's like alive! Get out! Ooh, jump out that window! Oh, we're all bloody now. That's really bad. Come on, Amanda. Get up. Okay, go to the car. What? Okay. The car just got eight. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. What? Oh my gosh. What is that? Bro. This dang monster house right now. Okay. We get chased by a house right now. We get chased by a house right now. Just run. Dude, he's coming closer. Oh my gosh. Run. Run. Get in the van. Get in the van. Who's in there? Who's, who is that? That car came out of nowhere. What? What? The house. So the house was alive the whole time. This was just basically just a monster house. You've seen that movie. Hey. That was a good game. That was a good game, man. That was the house. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I freaking love this game, actually. It was really fun. But that thing Scott, dude. Ah, man. That dude was tripping, man. All right. That was the end of the game, right? Or is it going to be like a after thing? On a Friday morning, Mark Williams, a 37-year-old plumber, was on a call to fix the plumbing in a house far from town. Their service van was found several miles away from the scene, and according to the investigation, it had probably collided with the truck. Mark Williams was never found. What? Oh, was that, was that the car that saved us? It's been more than 20 years since the disappearances of Scott Thompson, Ashley Rivera, Brian Jones, and Amanda Martinez. According to information provided by a shopkeeper and other witnesses in the nearby town, the youngsters were spending the weekend at a nearby house. Oh, we died! Dang, we did not make it out. In a statement, the parents of the young Scott Thompson, one of the missing reported, reported that they owned the house near the site, but had been demolished years ago. The documents and the police investigations at the site confirmed this. So the house was demolished? Why was it still like up then? Makes no sense. During the investigation, the police found a homemade mask and a bloody knife near the rubble in the old house. The blood on the knife was Scott Thompson's. 
Everything points to a serial killer, but even after years of searching, the suspect has never been found. What? We never saw that. We never saw some. Oh, that's. Even after years of investigation, the only concrete evidence the police found could find was that the place existed at some point in time. Wait, wasn't that Mask Scott when he was trying to scare us? Bruh. The house. Dang. So we didn't even make it out. What killed us? We were driving out of there. Did that house catch up to me? How? No signal. Oh man, that's creepy. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this um video of the house. If you want to check out the game, I'll leave it in the description. Oh, the game just closed. Um, I'll leave the game in the description. Thank you guys for watching this video and um, see you in the next one. Bye guys.